what up guys welcome to her in studios if you are new here make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell for more videos like this so today we are looking at how to take your just uh, images that you took with your phone and uh, make them into 3d portrait like you can see them in this music video right here so what you need to do first is to just download uh, this portrait from uh, polyhaven under 3d models so you have to go and then let's just search uh, the model go through by the way these models are free models you can just donate to uh, polyhaven so this is the one that we're looking for let's download it right quick so once it's done downloading uh, what you need to do is to extract it into a file This is the image that uh, you're trying to paint your image onto so that it can appear onto the 3d portrait you can use it into your video like animation into your video or you can also place them onto the wall so let's just open our 3d element under layout uh, we can check our 3d element here is our 3d element now let's go into the texture paint so that this is where we can paint our new image onto the existing image and we can use that for our own uh, say for instance movie uh, film or whatever we are trying to shoot like music video that you i showed you previously so what first thing that you have to do is to make sure that you don't paint onto uh, the outside of the portrait but you paint onto the image itself so as you can see there is the image itself so you have to ensure that uh, it's the one that is clicked at the moment so before you even uh, try to paint onto this uh, portrait so let's add our image i have my image there for salty boy beats advert it's a t-shirt you can go and check it out uh, i left the link in the description so what you need to do now is just go to the texture we need to uh, take this to stencil and image aspect ratio to be the full image aspect ratio let's turn it uh, to 270 degree to make it uh, into the way we want it and to move it you just uh, left i mean right click to move it let me just add my add-on so that you can see what i'm doing when i'm doing it uh, go to the add-on preferences add-ons uh, what we're looking for is the screencast keys so what you have to do is just click that one on and uh, you can press n or go to the right hand side and uh, choose a screen key i mean screencast keys and you should now see it uh, there but this is not for you guys i mean i'm just doing this so that you can see what i'm pressing when i'm pressing my keyboard or my mouse so let me just increase uh, the brush size as well move the image very well nicely yeah something like that <clears throat> let me increase the brush size to something that your pc can handle so let's just uh um prepare the painting now i'm doing the painting through my pc is a little bit laggy so don't mind that maybe you are using better pc than what i'm using at the moment so. almost complete and there we have it so by now we can leave uh, the painting i mean texture paint uh, into the layout and we will have uh, the fully uh, portrait so now let's just add uh, the the hdr uh, to put into i mean to put light into our uh, subject or our 3d element so i have this image that uh, downloaded from polyhaven as well let me just go through all these images there we edit it so now we have our image uh, with uh, the 3D world, uh, I mean the light onto our 3D model. 
so as you can see there and our what i like about this is you can see our image now it even have a texture onto it uh, i don't know if you can see it on youtube thank you for watching have a nice day and subscribe